It's a, it's a really, really tough chance. It's Chris Gow's now trying to reassert his dominance, particularly on Mark Gillespie. And it's working. That is massive. It's huge. It's in someone's backyard, and if you don't want to throw it back, folks, don't. Get them to sign it later. It's downtown. It has gone miles. It would have gone through the old Mackenzie stand. Doesn't he like hitting it's a big six on this ground? Test match, we saw one on the roof here right above us. And this one here, <laughs> into the backyard, and people, that is a huge hit. Yeah, don't, don't give it back, folks. It's one for history, because it would have hit the new Graham Lowe stand if it had been there. And, of course, uh, it would have uh, bounced back off the new Graham Lowe stand. Unbelievable. I mean, he's a big, big hitter anyway. He's been threatening to do this for about two years, to get one right out the screws. He's been swinging for two years, and this is... This is just literally the perfect kind of shot, isn't it? The we bat so... speed that's got into that, out the middle of the bat. I think there's a great reverse angle coming up now. I mean, that obviously just proves you hit it in the middle of the bat. But there's one that's sort of coming in a minute from third slip. And you mentioned golf. I mean, it's like a McElroy driver. Well, it is. It's like Look a golf follow-through. But, you know, when you hit it into the, the stand, it's a big hit. But that has hit the roof <laughs> and gone over it. That's that I'm seeing today off late, he hasn't batted in this fashion. Now what he knows is Andy Caddick knew that the ball was a bit too full, so he knew the compensation would be made with the length. So again, the master batsman reading the bowler's mind, all set to look for that short pitch delivery. And after a long, long time, I must say I'm seeing Tendulkar bat like he used to, looking to hit the ball in the air. It's been a natural lofter of the ball, looking to pull. And he was looking to pull for a six at all times. Have a look at this. Knew that Andy Caddick would adjust his length. He was there waiting for it. And I'm amazed that, that ball's come back. But it has, or it appears to. And he's after it. It was only a matter of time. It's on to the roof and over the roof. Just had a feeling that it was only a matter of time, Sanjay. Well, he's almost swung himself off the. It's a very, very big hit. Sweet, sweet, and out of the ground. That's a really big blow. Dangerous player. Akmar. Oh, nothing wrong with the option from Grant Elliott, but right in the slot, he would have preferred the length to be a little shorter. It's the off cutter this time. Mark oh, no. All power. It's the longest boundary on the ground. And I've been here a few times, Scotty, yeah, too. And not very often you see them whistled out of the ground in that direction. That's a big hit when you consider where the pitch is on the block. Yeah, I think it's bounced in the uh, Maguire Rentals car park. Uh, across the road there. Need a car, Simon, do you? Oh, no, it's, it's property rentals, Ian. Oh, yeah, nothing to do with cars, mate. John and Vicky. <laughs> OK. Good people, though, must say. That looks like Ken Rutherford's truck, actually, as well. I was going to say.